In his first public comments on the Ukrainian crisis, Russian President Vladimir Putin says that Moscow reserves the right to use its military to protect Russians there, but hoped it wouldn't need to do so. Putin declared that Western actions supporting the new government in Kiev were driving Ukraine into anarchy. There is only one assessment that can be made, and that this was an unconstitutional coup and armed seizure of power. Putin also warned that any sanctions placed on Russia will backfire. His comments came as U.S. Secretary of State John Kerry touched down on the Ukrainian capital Tuesday, showing support for the country's new government. At the same time, the U.S. announced a $1 billion aid package. Russian troops who had taken control of the Belbek Air Base in Crimea Tuesday fired warning shots into the air as around 300 Ukrainian soldiers who previously manned the airfield demanded their jobs back. Russia took over the Crimean Peninsula Saturday, placing its troops around the peninsula's ferry, military base and border posts. The new Ukrainian leadership in Kiev, which Putin does not recognize, has accused Moscow of a military invasion of Crimea. Meanwhile, the Kremlin says Putin has ordered the 150,000 Russian troops participating in military exercises near Ukraine's border to return to their bases. The massive military exercise in western Russia was due to wrap up anyway, so it's not clear if Putin's move was an attempt to heed the West's call to de-escalate the crisis. Tracy Brown, Associated Press.